refuge. Nation against nation, brother against brother, men so filled. Good evening and welcome to Deliverance Church Langata. This is the biblical perspective program. Uh, bringing uh, thoughts and confronting issues that are within the public domain, whether it's through the electronic media. We sometimes even respond to some of the issues within the social media, uh, but more we look at the real issues that are being reported uh, in the public press. And with me again to prosecute this program today is Gerard uh, Mwangi, uh, or the water fan, you say it. Karibu Asante sana. Asante Karibu sana. Uh, I think the first thing to react to, uh, and, and, uh, because it's something that is starting to raise some, uh, some concern, yeah. is the resurgence of, uh, of, of this reporting about the COVID-19. Yeah. You know, there's a degree in which yeah. we felt like we are going to what is going to be the post-COVID season. Yes. I don't know about where you, you, you stand, but yeah. I, I don't know whether people want to hypersensitize things that are really not very, very great concern. They create fear, yes, yes, and, yes. And, and it kind of interferes with the people uh, belief, and yeah. it destabilizes. I'm of the opinion, it's very, very important that people can take greater responsibility. Yeah. If you're not vaccinated, yeah. Yeah. I mean... We know there's so much immunization over the years. Yeah. What is, what is yeah. the big deal about yeah. the COVID vaccination? The vaccine, vaccine. Very good. Uh, because but, because yeah. it talked to anyone. Even though yes. you know, we started getting vaccination when we were very young, yes. Yes. it did not destroy us. This yeah. idea that came that, uh, that uh, this is the mark of the beast, this, yeah. is, this vaccination is, I mean, well, yeah. I, I get very concerned. Yeah. And... But I'm glad. I think from, from the statistics that have been yeah. given, yeah. I think they were talking about about 18 million Kenyans already in the vaccination uh, in the yes. bracket. Yeah. But they wanted yeah. to raise it to 60 yeah. percent. Kenyans, I think we always say prevention is better than cure. Yeah. Uh, COVID is real. We know there are people who are wiped out by COVID. Yeah. If, it's, if you can just take a responsibility of taking that vaccine, and, uh, and not being told that when you take it, you have the mark yeah. of the beast. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> or, or some things, I don't yeah. know where they came from. Yeah. Yeah. But, but yeah. uh, what do you think about the fact that yeah. just because, because you see, it started yeah. rising up, but the numbers were not, and I even had medics saying, please do not be over anxious about these about things. The, yes. we, have, we think yes. that a yeah. good number of Kenyans have been hardened yeah. against yeah. this thing. Yeah. But we are in a cold season. Yes. In a cold season, a sometimes can, yes. uh, can, can, yes. can uh, because this is a virus kind of a situation. Yeah. Yeah. So, so what do you think about what's going on? Uh, Doctor, you know, the, the debate of, first of all, I would like to state that um, conventional medicine. Yeah. Uh, we invested in it for many years. Yeah. Uh, from the time of uh, Marie Curie, uh, you know, all these individuals who have helped us yeah. come up with what is helping us to become better. Yeah. Um, certainly, uh, mm -hmm. the argument for vaccination is, is, is a commendable one. Yeah. And it's an acceptable one. I think where the challenge came in yeah. was the issue of who is uh, creating the vaccines. Yeah. Uh, what is in the vaccines. Yeah. And then when we had a bit of uh, discrepancies between yeah. The producers of the vaccine. Yes, yes. There is where people now <laughs> took advantage of the different theorizing of yeah. why you should not have the vaccine. Mm. Where is it coming from? Is it from India, China? Is it from the US? Mm. However, in, in research and in medicine, uh, vaccines have been known to work. Uh, in fact, I, I keep saying we have been focusing on the COVID one mm. and they have been working on a malaria vaccine for a very long time. Yeah. Now, some of those challenges is what makes some individuals say, what is the real, what is the reality of what's going on? We have been working on a, on, on a malaria vaccine for so long and it's not even mm. been, um, uh, what do you call it, produced so mm. far. Mm. We have been working also on a HIV 
vaccine yeah. and it's not been produced. Not so, really. so there was there was an element of where people started asking. And then you threw to us in the media that this has happened out of the carelessness of some individuals mm. in some place mm. and named certain countries. Mm. So in the midst of the geopolitics, the economics, and the sabotage of economics and, and, and the proponents of good economics, I think there was a challenge in getting people to believe in mm. something. Mm. And then throw in now, of course, the conspiracy theorists, yeah. then we're in trouble. Yeah. But having said that, I would agree with you in conventional medicine that it's good to prevent yeah. uh, than to, to be cured. Mm. Um, I've met people who have individual stance on, 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 on the matter. Mm -hmm. uh, I've met those who have no issue with it. Mm. Um, and of course, also into the, and the government also had a challenge uh, when you went into the mandatory mm. uh, aspect of it and there's yeah. also the legal aspect of the freedoms yeah. of yeah. individuals. Yeah. Yeah. So it's something that you have to, to weigh and balance, and balance well yeah. and get people involved in it. Yeah. Um, is it a good thing for us in the world? No, it has really cost us, uh, mm. whether it's in terms of fear, whether it's in terms of uh, the economy. Uh, it has actually really cost us. Um, there are people who are even speculating that as soon as we are done with, with, uh, with the elections, mm. uh, we might go back to the old uh, shutdown system. Uh, so a lot of people are concerned. Uh, may God, may God yes, forbid, because yes, yeah. uh, uh, I, th I believe that we are not where we used to be. Yes. Yeah. And I'm praying yeah. that... Yeah. Because it, it's been a very, very frustrating time. Yeah. Uh, especially when the church was closed for about six months. Yes. Uh, yeah. in, in 2020, I think it was it, 2020. Yes, from March, yes. Yeah. Uh, that was a very, very difficult time. Yes. Because uh, a lot of church suffered setbacks. The only thing yeah. it did, which is still positive, yeah. is that it made it necessary for us to up the games in terms of a media, media presence, yeah. and for the first time, yeah. uh, it was admitted that yeah. the religious uh, church programs yeah. and what was happening within the social media, yeah. it surpassed any other. In, in terms of in watching. In terms of what watching yes, and what was going yes, on. Yes, indeed. Yes. And, and we, 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 it's very clear in our mind, even yeah. if now things started going back to normal, yeah. We, we have never stopped airing our Program. services yeah. rife. Yeah. Uh, anybody in the world who has a f uh, internet can, can be able to be access. Able to access. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and that will not stop. Yeah. I mean, that, that is something that we have to carry. Yeah. There are certain realities we have to come to terms with. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But having said that, it's also good to, for people to understand yeah that there's nothing that can substitute your physical presence, presence in with other believers yes. in a church setup. Yes. Yeah. Uh, because yeah. it's the word of God that says in the book of Hebrews, yeah. uh, I believe it's 10, 25, yeah. that we should not forsake the coming together yeah. of the brethren, brethren. as yeah. the manner of some is. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, and, and I'm, I'm, there's a book and I feel bad because I was thinking by now this book will be out. Out, yes. But I, but, but I, I, it will come out, yeah. and I, I believe that uh, uh, I'll take time to to. I've been working through it yeah. to be able to to bring the uh, to talk about some of the suffering that the church went through. through. Yeah. In yeah. terms of creating what I define as spiritual lethargy. Okay. Yeah. Because. If there's anything COVID-19 did, did yeah. it created, it enhanced spiritual lethargy yeah. or slothfulness yeah. in that you yeah. could just have to follow uh, the pastor even from your bed. Yes. You yes. just need to have the yes. bundles. Yes. And the yes. pastor can be preaching in church, but yes. you are still in bed but, yes. uh, following. Yes. And yeah. that uh, has a very, very negative implication because... Yeah. It means then you can even doze off, off. and not listen. Yes, yes. Uh, the good thing or uh, positive is that, of course, it remains in the platform. Yes, yes. So when you're up, you can still watch it. Yes. Uh, I, I, I think that that's an issue that is yeah. of a great concern. Yeah. 
And so what my appeal to the Kenyans to regarding this issue about COVID uh, resurgence, yeah. let's take greater responsibility. Yeah. But also let us not be, uh, start creating fear, fear yeah. in the hearts of people. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, demanding that yeah. now everybody has to mask once again. Yeah. You know, this thing is back again. Yeah. Uh, let us listen to the medics. They say that we are also be overworried about this thing. Yeah. It is temporary. Uh, it's uh, being prepared because of the change of weather pattern, uh, uh, the way it is with the rains and colds. Yeah. But let us trust God yeah. that we are in the we are still in the post-COVID yes. season, yeah. Yeah. and this prayer doesn't come back. But that's that's yes. my prayer. Yeah. Now, uh, going back yeah. to the to what happened yesterday, yeah. uh, there's a lot of reaction that yeah. was in the media yesterday yeah. uh, because of people commenting yeah. uh, about the fact that this was the last official day. Yes, Madaraka. Madaraka. Yeah official uh, day for the president addressing the nation. Yeah. But uh, there was a broken protocol yes, in the so. fact that uh, as mm -hmm. it is expected that the, yeah. he will be presented to the public by his deputy who was present. Yeah. Uh, the president was presented by uh, the MC. It's the MC. Uh, what, uh, what, Mr. What you, uh, Mr. Anjohi, I believe. Yeah, uh, yeah, have, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, it's good to have Mr. Anjohi. But yeah. what, what do you think informed that? Um, in your view? Dr. I, I have encouraged people, yeah. besides the politicking uh, and the economic and policy, mm. to look at the psychology of we. Yeah. There are three elements yeah. when you observe what's happening in our country. Yeah. There's the element of the leadership, which yeah. is the presidency, yeah. deputy and the president. Mm. There is the element of the people they, they administer. Yeah. And there's the element of we, the followers. Yeah. Now, each one of us in those mm. elements have our psychology. Yeah. Informed by the media, mm. informed by themselves with their own mouth and what they say, mm. and informed by our perception of what they are saying. Now, if you listen to the leaders, one calls the other my brother continuously. Mm. But the brother keeps saying, you are backstabbing me continuously. Mm. Then the other says, we have forgiven the matters as the head of state. But you can tell now from an action like this that he's upset with something. Yeah. So, and I keep saying, it's just like in a marriage. If you do not sit down and address the matter directly yourselves, come to a place where you have concluded and say we will forgive each other for real and then take that over to the followers. Then the matters will only be looked at from a very a superficial point of view. I, I don't know if you were at the prayer breakfast. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah. Oh. Ah, yes, at breakfast. Huh? Mm. And the commitment there was forgiveness. Yeah. Forgiveness. Um, when I observed what happened on Madaraka Day, mm. I still keep asking myself, mm. what is it that really, really happened that we're not being told? No. That there must be something that, that, that took place that is so painful. That, you know, I, I, I know as a human being, there are times people have done something to me and have said, yes, I have, I have forgiven. But when I meet them, I still feel that burning effect in myself and I have to bring in that Christian aspect saying at least shake their hands so that you break the barrier and then give it time for healing then meet again and then when we meet is when I say you know even though I felt I forgave you there's this part that is still painful and I need to tell you so that I understand from you why did you do that to me so these two individuals there must be something and because we are not privy to them and whatever took place. Mm. That's the only explanation I can have mm. of what I am observing from the outside. Mm -hmm. But my message to all of them mm. is that we do hurt each other. We do get hurt. 
It is important sometimes because they are leaders at a, at a very high a level, very high level. That they, they must decide to sit and say for the sake of these people who are following us, in either side, we have to do something. Because if they don't do it, I will tell you where we are headed. It's the same history we had. And I have been a proponent of the handshake for mm. many years. Yeah. From not even when before it became. I personally had proposed such things even to members of both sides. And I would mm. get lambasted about it. And I would even be told I'm very naive and young and don't understand the dynamic of this nation. But there's one thing I've understood, Dr. Tari, uh, and that is from the Holy Spirit and people who are also people who are believers, mm. that if you do not sit with an adversary and mm. speak the truth mm. to each other, mm. truth to each other, you will not solve the problem. Yeah. So the equation of one ethnic community, the Lu and the Kikuyu, was something that had been put under the carpet. And now the truth, Dr. Tari, is coming out. How many people have you read saying, we set up propaganda to make this individual look bad? It is again recurring in now a new different face. The president and the deputy mm. must find a way, even when they retire or come out of the political scenario, must find a way to come back to the rest of us and say, it's three years ago. And this happened because of the following. We have sat and have concluded we want to come and tell you. Because the generations that are following these people will be passing on a, 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 a certain message that may be premised on the wrong thing. I want to say this to you of a story I read very quickly mm. about a lady who was cooking fish. Mm. And she happened to cook fish in a certain manner by cutting the head and the tail because mm. she found one part of the head of the, of the, of the fish was rotten. So throughout the family generation, they would cut the head and the tail without asking without why asking we cut what, the yeah. head and the tail. <laughs> and that became the thing. So if we don't do this, mm. there will be something that we will have done wrong for the nation. So whatever it is out there, the pain that is out there, because there is pain, yeah. Any psychologist yeah, who is studying yeah. and watching this, yeah. not from a, just a political point, will tell you there is pain between the two leaders. Now, what has caused that pain is what we don't know. Yeah. Well, for me, um, yeah. from a leadership perspective, yeah. and I'm a leadership student, yeah. and I'm also, I also train leaders. Yes. Yeah. A leader yeah. has to yeah. be very strong. Yeah. Emotionally, yes. Spiritually, yeah. mentally, really? yes. And if possible, even physically. Yeah. yeah. And the leader must be able to take in. Yeah. Uh, there a are lot. many, many times <laughs> yes. that you, as a leader, has to to restrain yourself. Yeah. Because sometimes we create yeah. anxiety. Yeah. Uh, in the in the in the in the minds of the people we lead, yeah. because of some things that we do that yeah. we should not do. We should not do. Yeah. yeah. Like now, yeah. uh, you know, Gerard. Yes. You and yeah. I. Yeah. Can still be considered to be people given to scholarship. Yes. At least we yeah. cannot. Yeah. Nobody can say we are rich. Yes. Yeah. We, yeah. We, and, we, and we are also family people. Yes. Yeah. In a family setup. Okay? Yeah. The husband yes. is the head of the family. Of the family, yes. Yeah. And there are so many things that the husband should be able to take in yeah. without becoming reactionary, yeah. without many things, just to be able to keep the family together. Together, yes. Yeah. In psychology, and you yeah. can ask any psychologist. Yes, yes. Yeah. Even for me, I'm, I'm leading a community here. Yes. I, you know, I have a group of... Yeah people who work for me. Yeah. yeah. If I victimize any of them, yeah. they are able to win public sympathy. A lot. And a lot of people will say, I'm abusing my yes. your, your position. position. Yes. Now, in yes. such a scenario, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, I bring it to anybody. Because yeah. you see, we say in a multitude of counselors, yes. there's safety. Yes. Yeah. Whoever would have 
who is counseling? Whoever would have dared yeah. to, to, to be able to create an impression yeah. Yeah. to the president yeah. that maybe you should consider disregarding, uh, I mean, not, not, not involving yeah. the deputy in, the, in your final address yeah. to the nation, yeah. is somebody who is, who did not, in my view, yeah. Yeah. give him uh, what I can consider to be wise counsel. Wise, yeah. Because yeah. you and I yeah. live in this country. Yeah. I don't yeah. remember one time yeah. that the what? deputy introduced yeah. the president to the public yeah. and did not praise the president yeah. for his accomplishment. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know? Do you, do you know, remember any yeah. time? Because any time yeah. he would talk about his infrastructure yeah. development, yeah. his what they have, what they yeah. have done. Yeah. The but, one, but the yeah. question is, yeah. you have said yeah. correctly, yeah. we all are left to guess, yeah. what is it? Yeah. And again, yeah. I was in the national prayer breakfast. breakfast. Yes. Yeah. I'm glad that this time around, instead of calling an external guest, yes. they used our leaders, leaders. here yes. to talk yes. to, to them. Talk to, yes. And let me tell yes. you, you yeah. go back, this is you yeah. on the social media platform. Yes. Yeah. The things that were spoken there were so weighty. Very. Do you understand? Very. And I still will never forget. I made note, Dr. Uh, uh, this, uh, this whole booklet at yeah, the back yeah. is just about that. So <laughs> I was there. <laughs> yes. I was personally there. Yes. And let me tell you, especially yes. uh, the deputy president yeah. uh, did some very unusual things. Yes. Yes. Uh, when he broke protocol to invite a uh, mother. Uh, mother, yes. Yeah. It was not expected. Yes. Yeah. And he said, I'm sorry if I you know, messed up your demand. This yes. I thought was necessary. Yeah. Then. Yeah. When he spoke, yeah. you know, there's a point in which yeah. I'm almost wishing if that was the last uh, impression, uh, impression that people, people yes. Because <laughs> yes. you remember yes. when, when, when yeah. the deputy yeah. was saying how he wishes the president about his retirement well, for peace yes. and whatever. And he said yes. very good stuff. Yes. And when the president was closing his marks, yes. he, he responded said, to that. He actually said, William, I hope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That this <laughs> prayer, you know, this yeah, prayer this yes, shall come to pass. Do you understand? Uh, yes. That yes. was very positive. Yes, yes. But yes. now. And even looking at the facial expression, because yeah. I like looking at their faces. Yeah. Right? Uh, I found some, you know, you could read genuineness yeah. in the two at yeah. that point. At that point. I, I've, I've read others where if I must, I can, I can give an opinion. But you see, there's something but that happened could, also yes, yes. That, were, yeah. were, that people uh, yeah. captured the fact that they, they yes. used uh, two different tables. Yes. But, but yes. Uh, they, 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 well, for me, uh, you know, sometimes you can read what you want to read what out of the, yes, yes. But um, yeah. The, the, the reality is yeah. that was very positive. It was, it was a positive. Then, yes. then, yeah. then even asking for forgiveness. Yes. Saying, yes. you know, please, you know, yeah. where I disappointed you, you know, yeah. and you know, my friend, you know, forgive yes. me. And yeah. it went very well. Yeah. Also saying so, that uh, even those who did offend him, yeah. is it true that yes. he has been offended? Offended, yes. Is yeah. it not true? Now, this is the point, Dr. Ali, that I've observed. Yeah. And, and, and I'm glad you have used the family, <laughs> because even within the family, yes, we, we do yes, this. Yes, eh? yes, yeah. You'll, sometimes the leaders, yeah. uh, wife, spouse, man and wife, will agree now these matters are ready to rest. But within the family, we also know that uh, our children yeah. also have studied us very well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so they can, they can also take advantage of, of the scenario. What I have observed is like after the breakfast, I said this is a wonderful message. Wonderful. I, know, and yeah. I, I went talking to everybody who, can, uh, who cares to listen. Mm. But what I also realized is that as this is happening, now the followers who are not with them, if you turn on the news that day, mm -hmm. are busy saying the total opposite thing yeah. of yeah. what this, <laughs> the, the, the very leaders have said. And I think that is the sad part where I keep saying, Dr. that we must, we must insist yeah. that this nation shall not be ruled with fear and abuses, and we must hold people to a high account. In fact, Dr. for me, yeah. I would want to see a law that outlaws any individual who is not able to restrain themselves from abuses, mm -hmm. who comes and lies about you as a person, demeaning and, mm -hmm. uh, and, and also defaming you as a person, so that we help our, our communities to stick to facts 
and to stick to a healthy competition. So if I'm going to compete with you, mm. I must come and say what I have done. In fact, mm. I have even advised my young friend, don't go talking about your incumbent, what, what they have not done. You talk about what you will do. And you talk about what you have done. So that we, we move away from this thing of saying, Daktari did not do this. By the way, do you know where he comes from? But, you know, that's the trap we keep going into. Uh, yes. As we, we yeah. come to the closure of yeah. our conversation today, yeah. first is to pray that the electoral body, yeah. which has owned to the fact that from the chair, yeah. as reported by Collins Omulo yeah. in the Nation yes. Media Group, that the Electoral Commission has admitted illegal transfer of voters ahead of the August 9 election is going on. And warned of stern action against its officers who are involved. Who are involved. So it's officers, the officers involved. Of IABC. Yes. The Independent yeah. Electoral Barriers Commission said it had launched investigation into the illegal transfer affecting its electronic register. Yeah. Chairperson Wafura Chibukati said any individual transferred without their knowledge yeah. will be returned to their collect voting station. Yeah. He pointed out that the register is managed and owned by registration officers in in 290 constituencies and 47 counties which are fully in charge of it. However, any activity on the register yeah. was blocked after May 4th yes. for verification. Yeah. So there was a timeline. Yes. There's a time yes. you would have done it yes. Yes. and you're allowed to, yeah. but from the, May, yeah. you couldn't. Yeah. As a commission, we do not condone such as it is against the rights of Kenyans at Article 38 of the mm -hmm. Constitution yeah. to be registered to vote in the place of their choice. Yeah. Cases of transfer without one's knowledge shall be investigated. In yeah. fact, the commission has called on all the, tr all the transfer forms yeah. which to are already with yeah. us. Yeah. If there are such cases, yeah. if there is any officer who was involved in such an illegal yeah. transfer, yeah. stern action will be taken against them. Yeah. According to an internal memo, May 25th, the commission said its preliminary uh, mm. analysis of the register voter reviewed there could be some transfers of voter affected of, without yeah. the supporting uh, statutory forms. Yeah. And the without the knowledge of even the voters. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. This, yeah. uh, this is to instruct you to urgently and immediately reverse all transfers that are unsupported yes. by any documentation, including yeah. application from yeah. and a copy of an education document. Yeah. It's part of the letter. Yeah. Now, let me ask you this. Yes. Whoever did this, yeah. whose interest are they serving? Dr. Tari, and we need to wind up. Very quickly. In fact, even you yourself, you should check, first of all, which party you belong to. Yeah. You might... Some people have not subscribed to any party. Yeah. I checked and I found myself in a party, yeah. which I never subscribed to. Yeah, yeah. I did not have, I did. But when I checked, yeah. I found out I was in a party. Yeah. Now, now mm. deliberately, I did move to a certain party. Yeah. But I can tell you there are many people, and yeah. even the ones watching, who are in parties and they are not aware. Right yeah, now, right they're now. in parties and they're not aware. Yeah. So I would advise anybody who is watching to find out. Mm. See, it doesn't matter which party you want to be in, as long as it's your own choice. Uh, <laughs> as we come to the close of yeah. this program today, yeah. I want to really pray and urge uh, that Christians everywhere, we continue praying. Yeah. And don't forget yeah. that God, our, our work, according to the book of uh, uh, Proverbs 16, verse 33, Ours is to cast the vote, vote. Yeah. but the determination of the outcome it belongs to, to God. The... Lord, we ask that you remember this nation at this time, mm -hmm. even as we go into elections in a mm -hmm. few, uh, just in not many days ahead, that you, have, you will raise the people mm -hmm. and the person, particularly in the office of the president, mm -hmm. that you have chosen in Jesus' name. Mm -hmm.